That's... I mean, just, I mean, you got the stamp of approval. I mean, just look at those pupils. He's just looking into your soul. Makes you feel the fear. <laughs> That's it, and fear. Oh, we're in winner's final. Or was that winner's final? I mean, just the utter look of disgust on him. It's just like, you're so pathetic. <laughs> Such a worthless creature. It's like, why do you I can exist? just size strike you and insta death. <laughs> why am I the Pokemon? I'm the Pokemon master. <laughs> You should be the Pokemon. <laughs> I should be calling on you. Get in my Pokeball. <laughs> Get in my. Make me call on Let's you. See. Ash catch him. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> I jump kick now, mother. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Let's. Oh God. That's how Mewtwo is, though. He makes you feel bad about Let's what see. happens to him. Let's oh, see. You know, when, when fourth gen came around, when was that? 2006. God, yeah. that was over 10 years ago. Why isn't there a remake? But anyways, I digress with that. Um, <laughs> I got so upset with Arceus, because I'm like, no, Mewtwo is the Pokemon. It's true. He Mewtwo is. is the. But they all, but they made lore like Arceus was the was god, the god. Of well, all Pokemon. I'm like, that's, I don't that's like not it. okay. Mewtwo like it. has always been. I'm, gonna get on the, I'm, a, I'm a Gen 1-er, getting on the Gen 1 bandwagon. Pokemon Go? First of all, worst game is. in existence, but still fun. First of all, there is no such thing as a Gen 1 uh, <laughs> bandwagon. You are either Gen 1 or nothing. Because <laughs> <laughs> Gen 1 is the best Gen <laughs> ever. <laughs> you know, those those newbies will be like, Man, the mechanics are so bad in competitive play. Well, the, I don't play competitive. All, it's a Pokemon. You weren't around. You were too young for the Pokemon know. Gen 1 mania. That was so fun. You know when Butterfree, when he released Butterfree, tears. Tears. My eight-year-old tears cried. coming down. I Anyways, cried. well, <laughs> Jeb and Sylvanas lose their finals. Got some momentum, momentum, Mr. Sylvanas. And again, another bag. And once right here, they caught each other already, haven't they? Jeb. You know, it's like, it's welcome it. back. <laughs> no, I, I think it was Geist that they played, the other band. Uh, was, was it? I thought it was Jeb yeah, versus Sylvanas. I might be wrong, but either way, I'm, there's I'm, so I'm, many Bayos and Mewtwo. Believe it or not, sometimes I am not. Okay. Sometimes I'm not a perfect human being. It's very rare, but sometimes. <laughs> sometimes I make mistakes. <laughs> so, so, so. It's not the best, but not perfect. <laughs> but I try. I see. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, multi hip. Wow. That was a pretty awesome witch time, like Ooh. neutral air. Caught still on a soft guard, I think, a little bit. Just held out that shield. He could have punched that. Oh, yeah. And again, oh, that's the second time he's done that. He needs to hold off on that approach option. I think he needs to find a way to kind of approach safer yeah. when it comes to I, I mean, that, that aerial dive kick was pretty good. Exactly. That, um, that, that's, that, that's a really good way to kind of approach me to. And we'll do it again. And uh, he's like, no. Nah, <laughs> Rinse and repeat. Me about this life. Let's see. Oh, oh, is he taking him off? Let's see. Oh. oh. Went too deep. Uh, Let's see. He thought it was Fox. <laughs> <laughs> No, I did not know this, but Fox has like one of the best recoveries. Goes so deep to almost kill zone and finds a way to get back. Uh, it surprises me every time. The trajectory is pretty linear. It's like, what uh, did you say Fox, right? Yeah, Fox. Yeah. <clears throat> it's like super straight, but yeah. like if you hit the stage at the right angle, it just slides right on my side. Gotcha. How is this possible? Sakurai, do you, do you need help with programming? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's not how we do things. Oh, Ooh. and the call out. So, um, I did not see a Smash Switch at E3. What's your opinion of that? Uh, Anything. People were hoping, you know, a virtual council, a remake of some sort with Melee, or... People were saying a lot of stuff, but nothing happened. I don't know. I feel like... If anything, go do a remaster for the Switch. I don't for see melee or uh, like a like Smash Four. four. Smash okay. Four. I feel like they're going to probably do like a remaster for Smash Four. Um, just On because it. Sakurai has made it perfectly clear that he's, he's like another thing to take into consideration is the. GameCube controller adapter. Exactly, and they, I think they mentioned that even then they have something about something about GameCube, uh, GameCube uh, 
support uh, in yeah, some support way. in some way. I hope. Yeah, because if that's the case, I feel like a lot of people would be happy to know that there's a possibility Smash yeah, uh, let, Let's say hypothetically Smash Switch does come out. Ooh, there so is a takes up it. smash. Man, and he knows this matchup. He, he does. Knows, he definitely. Barely took any percent on that second stock. Took first stock with ease. Uh, but but let's just say hypothetically Smash Switch comes out. And, you know, it's just they release everything with all the DLC. Nothing else changes. Yeah. Um, but no GameCube controller at Apple. Um, that will make a split in the community a little bit. They would have to make a decision of, uh, you know, and I don't think people would go to the Switch route. People would be they like, won't. no, 90% of the community use the GameCube controller. Like, even when the Wii U came out and the Pro Controller, people frowned upon using the Pro Controller yeah. over the GameCube controller. And they purposely <laughs> made a GameCube adapter. Heck, one of the this. TOs this match, or, or this tournament, there's always one, one guy with a Pro Controller, and it's always synced up to some random TV. All the time. Yeah. I used to use a Pro Controller myself, yeah. and I just, I loved it, but, uh, my uh, person that ran this tournament let me use his. Okay. Love it. Thick, yep. thick handle makes it easy to handle. Yep. So um, we're getting into game two. Savannah's versus Jeff. Changing Savannah's. his color. The color yeah. meta change. It's a meta game switch. Yeah, it's. I mean, let's, let's, let's be see. honest. You don't feel what? like it's your character. That was such a good mix up option. Just that, that micro microsecond and uh, changing. Oh, changing the move. And up so Bond the is making it look free. Yeah, I know. He knows he, he is feeling himself, and he's been feeling himself for a while. Just exuding he's warm. Yeah, he's warm. He he's fought two bayos. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> he's fought two bayos. <laughs> bayos. He's a bayo fiend. That's all it is right Let's now. See. He's like going <laughs> going in the club again. Is like, hey, where my bayos at? He's like, <laughs> goes to the club, says. How many bales I took out on YouTube That's in it. one tournament? That's I took two. <laughs> and all of a sudden, everybody That's dropped. <laughs> oh, yeah. And, and it's not like Sabanis is changing oh. anything. He's kind of keeping the same thing. It's just Jeb is not adjusting. And you know, he's just recently. making... Like, he's doing a little bit the same stuff, but he's barely, like, doing half a second mix-up, which is just enough Ooh. to make the difference between, like, a spot dodge or a roll. Yeah. Or drop shield, stuff like that. Exactly. Um, I feel like Sylvanas is just keeping a good pace. He's, he's setting the pace. Unfortunately, Jeb is falling in it. Yep. And he's, keep, he's falling into his uh, baits and everything. He's so, a little bit lost. Yes. I feel like... Maybe if uh, you see, yeah, you see him just jumping the platforms. He's just kind of thinking, he, thinking it through. What should I do? Yeah, because I mean, technically, that's what you have to do if you're in that situation where, a, he's at a high percent. He just took a stock off, and you two is not. Ooh. Oh, and eight a shadow ball to the chest, which makes it worse now because <laughs> it's almost a hundred percent. Oh, and the fair. Oh. Catches him off guard. Oh, and a call out. Bayo's Ooh. got 99 jumps. And that spot jump. Fair. Another Man, fair. He is just kill. relentless. Sylvanas so is coming out strong against Jeff and calling him out on everything that Bayonetta does. And it's just like a repeat of the last round, too. Yep. Um, Mewtwo barely taking any damage on that second stock before ending Jeff. Um, do you right. think Again, Jeb, a different color change. Do you think Jeb should switch to Lucas? Because he had a good run, uh, at least. Sylvanas knows the Lucas matchup. He plays Does Lucas. He? Ah, but you know it's 2-0. Oh. And you know he did that last time with uh, Cosmos. Did he? And it didn't work out. Yeah, that's right. But I mean, he did a little bit better <laughs> with the Lucas. Yeah, that bear spike was high. Oh yeah. He's just like, get down there. All right, so we're in game three. It's now 2-0. Uh, Savannah's having two, Jeb having zero. See, um, that's that Bayo strut. You gotta strut the, you gotta strut it. You feel confident no matter what. Throwing out 
Oh, got Shadow Ball. See, that's a, a really good thing. A lot of people... Hey, Sylvanas, Sylvanas is really good at showing us the we the weaknesses in Bayo. Oh, yeah. How, you know, her neutral isn't the best. But people just fall for yeah. the Bayonetta shenanigans. Yeah. And it looks like... No, Jeff's still getting a little bit of damage on there, but that ledge kind of messed him up a little bit. Moved him just out of the witch time area of effect there. <laughs> He's been like, camping the platform quite a bit. That's his best bet right now. Yeah, so. Play it he's safe, just, approach when you can. And, and you know, he's just thinking to himself how he should approach. How he should approach just this game and the set in general. Oh, yeah. Just like, I'm now, now 2 0. What can I do? I mean, look at look who you're going up against. Sylvanas is being really tough to fight. The read! The call out! And the perfect pivot. Make sure shield. he's put a dominance over here. But he is in loser's final. So if he loses, he's out. Same thing with Jeff. So I can see why they're hungry for this type of kills oh. here. Making sure they make it to the top. And again, there's no reason for someone else to approach. No reason. No reason at all. Oh, Eminem. Okay, I'm trying to get something started. And again, it's just shadow balling it up, and Jeb doesn't have an answer. Exactly, and uh, that's a bad thing, really, because if you let you two have that shadow ball, that gives you another option to avoid. And you don't want that, yeah. especially at this level right now, where you know you're on your last game. And you're on your he's last just time. he's just peppering damage, and then he's just hot, holding on to that shadow ball, exactly. see if he can get that kill option. Jeb needs to take off this stock because what's keeping this ooh, uh, what's keeping this barely afloat is the fact that Savan still has that first stock can take that out and then try and combo him off, do some bayonet shenanigans off the top to the side. See, and you know, we, we look at we look at top um, Mewtwo's, and they all have different styles. You know, we see Wadi, uh, more reserved. I see Sylvanas is more like Wadi than, uh, you know, there's oh, yeah. also Rich Brown, and uh, he, he loves his Nair, Rich Brown. And that was a nice little DI there. Oh, that and that's will be it. All right, Bayo at magic percent. Now all he needs to do. Is no hope, no. Magic percent is gone. <laughs> See, Mewtwo just needs to get Bayo above 100 to be able to get that up throw kill. Yeah, I think that's really what he's doing. He's just poking, doing little bits of damage here and there until he can get an opening with a. Shadow Ball. I mean, Savant's been putting that. style on this. Yeah. So finishing off with style. Ooh, Bayo. You yeah. know, he's just kind of falling flat on his Bayo combos. I, he's hesitating. Yeah. If you notice, he doesn't go directly to the spot where he thinks they are. Yeah. He's just kind of hesitating for a moment. And that's what's giving Savannah a moment to get himself out of it really quick and not being able to rack up damage is really hurting Bayonetta. Yeah, he's trying to go for that up throw. Or I don't know if it'll kill right now. Uh, I think it will, because okay. isn't it oh, oh, and that's now be it, it would kill, but it's that's gonna over be it. at a 3 oh, so far. So he's not Grants. He is feeling himself. He's feeling it. That's he it. is feeling it. Oh, it's the run back. Oh, are, are we on grand finals now? Let's see. Oh, snap. We are at what we all been waiting for. Grand <laughs> Cosmos finals. has been waiting for a long time. <laughs> he says, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm feeling it. Let's see. I'm ready. Where's my money? Go. Where's my money?